everyone, welcome to my channel, 10 Ways to Wear It, your home for relatable, wearable, and affordable fashion. I'm Alicia, and today's video is all about 10 spring outfits that you probably already have in your closet. If you wanna shop your closet and save some money this spring, I got you on today's video because I think a lot of the items you're gonna see, you already have. So if you need some outfit ideas, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Okay, you all, so you know we have outfits to get into in today's video, but we also have a sponsor. Here's a word from today's video sponsor, Billy. Today's video is sponsored by Billy. Billy has become my go-to brand for all my shaving needs, but what you may not know is that Billy now has a skincare line that features deodorant, body wash, and lotion. The variety, quality, and personality of their products has certainly won my heart. These days, I can't take a shower without them, and they leave my skin smelling so fresh and so clean. I mean, just look at that lather, and that's just with a small amount of the body wash. You can definitely see the quality. It is truly amazing. And when I follow this up with the deodorant and lotion, it leaves me so fresh. Their AHA deodorant is formulated with a powerful blend of potent acids that kill odor-causing bacteria and help combat ingrown hairs and discoloration. Their all-day deodorant is aluminum and baking soda free. It glides on weightless without causing caking or staining on clothing. Their body wash is vegan and paraben free, dermatologist approved, and gentle enough for everyday use. And their amazing body lotions encourage deep hydration and each one is designed with a different target in mind to give your body just what it needs. Billy definitely went the extra mile on these products and now it's time for you to go the extra mile for yourself by clicking the link in the description or you can also find all of these products at your local Walmart. Billy's products are high quality, they're affordable, they're absolutely wonderful and in my opinion they also look pretty adorable so you have every reason to go and check them out. And don't forget to check out their shaving products as well, they are the best on the market. Click that link in the description or check them out at your local Walmart. Thank you so much, Billy, for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get back into it. Alrighty, folks, here is my first outfit. And this is about as simple as it gets when it comes to a spring outfit for me. And I think this is something that most women have in their closet. It's basically a black jumpsuit. It's a thin, lightweight jumpsuit. It has like a surplus neckline with a little polo collar on it. This is from Fashion Nova. It's so cute and very, very classy. And it comes also in a burnt orange. I didn't get that one, but I wish I would have. But it also comes in regular and plus size. So I will leave the link for you guys or the name of this item because some of Fashion Nova's items I'm not able to link. But I'll definitely make sure you are, are able to find it. But I paired it with these cute sandals that I also got from Fashion Nova. They're like a gladiator sandal. They are so nice and they are so comfortable oh my god i am shocked at these sandals i just gotta say that y'all but what i just went ahead and did to finish off the look was just drape a striped sweater over my shoulders this sweater is from shein i will leave the link for it and i also paired it with this straw bag this is from amazon it's like a little leather and basket weave type of bag and threw on some accessories and that's the look all you need to do is finish this with some cute little sunglasses and you out the door this is a really easy spring look it's something you can also wear in the summertime if you're like a very conservative dresser during summer this is ideal because this jumpsuit is really thin it's good quality but it is really thin so this is the first look you all simple cute classic i like it let's move on this next look is another really simple go-to spring outfit for me and for a lot of you ladies out there and it's basically a white button-down shirt and jeans i paired it with tan accessories so i have on a tan colored brown belt and tan colored slides those are from shein my belt is from target and i threw in this little tan bag from shein and this is a super simple look but it's one of those looks that you can always count on if you feel me like you know that when you put on your favorite jeans or a good pair of jeans and a white shirt it's always going to work out like you don't have to worry about it whether you're going to pair it with something cute as far as your outerwear or you're going to keep it simple and wear it like this it works um, but this is always a go-to for me pretty much year-round but I did pull out a little cardigan to pair with this outfit because you know sometimes you need a little outerwear for spring you, 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 a lot of these days be rainy and cold it's actually raining today here in Southern California so I know that spring days can definitely be rainy they can be cold they can you know definitely be like not sunny and flowers blooming and all that so here's like a cute colored cardigan this is like a limey type of color almost like a chartreuse and i think it looks so good over this outfit and you can definitely pair any cardigan that you have let me fix my clothes y'all 
You can definitely pair any cardigan that you have with an outfit like this. But I love the way the tan pops against this green. I think it looks so cute. Give you guys a quick spin. This sweater is from Amazon. I will link it. It comes in so many different colors and it's very affordable. So simple look overall. Okay, slides, jeans, white shirt, tan accessories, but you can do black accessories. You can do whatever you want to do as far as that. And I finished it with a bright colored cardigan. So hopefully you all have this look. I'm pretty sure you do, but we're going to go ahead and move on to the next one. Alrighty folks, here is my next spring friendly outfit and I really like this one. I don't wear shorts a ton, particularly shorts that are not denim. I probably have like two pairs. This being one of them, I fell in love with these shorts from H&M because they have a cute little sailor button detail on the pockets. I love that and I paired it with this striped black and white shirt from Shein. I think this is the perfect shirt to pair with these shorts because the stripes somehow complement that like sailor detail and it all feels very nautical in my opinion. Very simple outfit if you don't wear shorts or you don't have shorts in your closet because you may not. You can always replace the shorts with a pair of black trousers. They can be slim fit or wide leg trousers. But I did go ahead and link some similar shorts for you all in regular and plus size. So if you want to check the description, I've linked those as well as my shirt down there. I paired it with these gladiator sandals again from Fashion Nova because I'm just in love with these sandals. They're so comfortable and cute. And then I also threw in this little simple bag that I picked up from Amazon. So really cute classic look very very monochrome black and white and i think this is a really great look for a lot of occasions if you're going to brunch lunches maybe you're doing like a you know off the wall type of business meeting where it's like on the beach or something this would be a really cute outfit to wear and you can always like throw on a cute little hat or something like that to finish it off it's very conservative in my opinion even though i am wearing shorts i still think it's very classic and conservative so i like this look it makes me feel good hope you guys like it too i've linked it below so Check the description if you want to recreate. Okay, here is my next spring outfit. And this one is one that you may or may not have because not everybody has a white denim skirt. And that is what I'm wearing in this look. I'm wearing a Medaxi, that's midi and maxi length denim white skirt. This is from Forever 21. I picked this up at like the end of 2022, but I did link some similar options that I found for you all. And I paired it with this striped blue and white shirt. This is like an oversized cotton poplin shirt. It's from H&M. I've also had this for quite a while, a couple of years at least. I decided to do tan accessories because I think tan goes so well with a look like this. When you're wearing this type of color scheme, I think tan is like definitely a go-to versus like black or cream or something like that. You might be able to do taupe as well. It would be pretty classic, but I think tan really is like that cherry on top of an outfit like this. You can certainly replace the white denim skirt with white jeans or white trousers in a look like this and just do that with the striped blouse. But I love this look. Another classic one, very, very upscale looking, great for like a nice spring day. You can always finish this with like a tan colored moto jacket. You can do a classic colored trench coat, you know, that khaki or taupe colored trench coat, or you can do something like chocolate brown as well. You can definitely mix colors with an outfit like this. As long as you stay like in the neutral family, I think it'll work. But I really, really like this look. I think it came together so nicely. And this is definitely something that I'll be wearing. The shirt is pretty oversized. I would prefer a more fitted blue and white striped shirt because I had a time tucking this sucker in. But I'm going to work with what I have because I'm just trying to shop a lot less these days. So I'm using pieces that I've had for quite some time, you guys. I hope y'all appreciate that, okay? <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and move on to our next spring outfit that is hopefully in your closet. Alrighty folks, here is my next outfit and honestly when I think of spring, bright colors is something that always comes to mind. It generally is the time that we get to pull out our bright colored tops and bright colored dresses and things like that, bright colored swimsuits and so I love to wear brights during the spring and that's basically what I did in this outfit. I paired this bright orange button down cotton poplin shirt from Fashion Nova with these cuff jeans. These are by the brand YMI Jeans. They are from TJ Maxx. I also threw on my orange and white Nike Air Max from Nordstrom and a little orange bag. And I like this outfit. This is just a no brainer. Um, I think this is a really good go to for spring. If you have like any color, bright colored top, you can throw it on with your jeans. You don't need these specific sneakers. You can do white sneakers. You can do some slides if you want to. But I think this is a great go to and it's suitable for a lot of different occasions. And I actually really love this shirt because 
because you barely need to iron it. So I'm gonna link it for you guys. It comes in regular and plus size and it comes in like quite a few colors. But yes, simple outfit, bold, bright colors, super cute and simple. I've also linked some similar cuff jeans for you all because I don't think these are still available, but I did find some other options that are very, very similar. And of course I linked my sneakers for you, but I like this look. I think it's kind of fun. Definitely an easy go-to that I use for spring as well as summer, but generally in summer I'll do something like cropped or midriff that's in a really bright color. So just kind of putting a little spin on this same combination, but love it. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the next outfit. This next outfit is another really simple one that I'm sure a lot of you ladies out there have in your closet already. And it basically features a pair of wide leg black trousers and a white t-shirt. Now of course my white t-shirt is a graphic tee, it just says runway on it. I thrifted this a few years ago and I also paired the look with my black and white Nike pandas, the dunks. And I have on this crossbody coach bag. But like I said, this is something most of you probably already have in your closet. Um, you may not have like a white graphic tee that has writing on it, but you do have a white t-shirt, I'm sure, ladies, right? <laughs> and you can pair it with any sneakers, slides, heels, whatever you wanna do on your feet and whatever bag that you have in your wardrobe already. But this is like a great running around on the weekend outfit where you just wanna look really pulled together, but you don't wanna put a lot of thought into it. Ideally, I would definitely finish off this look with my LA baseball cap from Amazon, but I didn't want to pull it out. So yeah, that's how I would finish this off. But you can always, as far as I wear, finish this with a cardigan, a moto jacket, a bomber jacket, um, a puffy coat, a puffer, puffer vest, a lot of different options as far as how to finish this one off. But I think this is a really cute, very simple look and it comes together so nicely. You can never go wrong with a black and white monochrome look, no matter how casual or how dressy. Something about black and white always works, but I really like this for a running around type of spring day. So definitely we'll be rocking this one because this is like definitely a look that is like something I gravitate towards. So easy fit, try it out, let's move on. Alrighty folks, here is my next outfit and this is definitely something I think a lot of you out there will have in your closet. It's a black dress. Mine is an A-line shape dress. This is from ASOS. You have seen this dress styled up quite a bit because I love this dress. But I've linked some similar options for you all. I found quite a few that are pretty similar in shape and of course they are black. I paired it with this striped cardigan. This is from ASOS. I've had it for a while but I did link some similar options of this as well kept on my black sandals from Fashion Nova because I love them. And I threw in this black bag that you see all the time. So really cute look. I think cardigans are like so good for spring, especially like spring transition, when you're transitioning from winter into spring. They're so awesome because you can layer and you can take it off as needed. If it's a warmer spring day, you can tie it around your waist or tie it on your shoulders. And then you can put it on as the day gets a little bit cooler. So cardigans are a really great thing. Whether it's a short one like this or a midi length one or a longer one, axi length, they all work for spring. So I love a good cardigan, but this look is overall very, very simple. I'll spin around and show it to you all. Give you the full tour. Black dress, striped cardigan, black bag, black sandals. I'm sure you got it in your closet. And if you don't, I've linked it for you so you can go get it. <laughs> Let's go ahead and move on to the next outfit. Here is another spring outfit that I think a lot of you ladies probably already have in your closet. Emphasis on probably, okay. But I'm basically wearing white linen trousers from Abercrombie & Fitch with a black t-shirt. This is from J. Crew. I decided to pair it with tan accessories, so I have on some cute little tan slides from Zara that I've had for a couple of years. Tan belt from Target and my little tan she-in bag. I thought they would be perfect to finish it off. This is another classic black and white outfit. And like I said, you can never go wrong with black and white. You do not need to have expensive pieces. You don't need to go spend a lot of money to make a black and white outfit look very luxurious, upscale, and designer in my opinion. Throw on some nice sunglasses and you're good. And that's what I love about this combination. And as I'm going through like this style evolution, I'm finding that I'm gravitating towards outfits like this a lot more because they do give you that upscale really simple look they don't require a lot of thought and they really can be enhanced in simple ways like with your accessories you know I do nice gold watch this is my Invicta watch some simple rings and things like that it elevates it so easily versus like a maximalist look where you're like trying so hard to make it look upscale girl let me tell you when I keep telling y'all I'm going through a style evolution trust me 
you are witnessing it before your eyes. I gravitate towards looks like this a lot more these days. So I really like this one. It's very simple. I'll give you guys a spin. Classic, easy, comfortable, fit for a lot of different occasions. I mean, you just can't go wrong with it. If anything fails, you guys, go with black and white, okay? <laughs> if you can't figure out your outfit, if you're confused, if you're having like a day where you're rushing, trying to find something to wear, go with black and white, okay? <laughs> That's what I did here and it always works. Let's go ahead and move on to the next look. Here's my next spring outfit that I think most of you probably already have in your closets. It's very simple, a white dress and a denim shirt. I decided to do a denim shirt instead of a denim jacket because I just feel like it's more relaxed but you can definitely do a denim jacket. I have a denim jacket. I just wanted to do a denim shirt for some reason. Like I think it's so much more casual than a denim jacket. And sometimes a denim jacket can actually unintentionally really dress down a look more so than a denim shirt. So I just decided to do this Levi's denim shirt. My dress is from Dianu. You all saw this on one of the hauls that I worked with them on. And I paired it with these platform lace-up sandals. These are from ASOS. I've had those for years in this little white and brown bag and this is such a nice look this dress is like everything it's sort of like an a-line drop waist dress and it has a little cut out here and it's just beautiful and it has pockets so love that here's a little spin for you guys and like i said went with that denim shirt instead of a denim jacket but you can always go with a denim jacket if that's what you have in your wardrobe but i think like a kind of oversized denim shirt really goes great with like a white dress especially if it's like a maxi length white dress but you can recreate this look with a shorter white dress as well and as far as the shoes you can do slides you can do sneakers a lot of different directions you can go as far as the shoes so super cute look i really like it i think it's simple casual cute and great for spring so let's go ahead and move on to our last spring outfit in the video Alrighty, here is my last outfit in the video and you may or may not have similar pieces to this in your closet or in your wardrobe, but I think you might have like the essence of these pieces. Basically, I'm wearing denim shorts. I think every lady has those. Maybe not my mature ladies who just are done with shorts, but I think for the most part, most of us have at least one pair of denim shorts. I paired it with this striped pink and white blouse. This is a recent purchase from Target's from the A New Day collection. And I've had this Topshop blazer, which is part of a suit for like, I don't know, six, seven years. I also threw on these neon colored sandals that match the blazer and I love this. So basically how you would recreate this is with your denim sh shorts, a striped shirt or you can do a plain white shirt and a blazer on top and throw on some sandals and you have the look and I mean what is spring without a little cute pair of city shorts okay city trends <laughs> do any of you guys follow Kerwin Claiborne he always does like the narration over the monkeys who like take pictures with people and they always have on like these like really funny outfits and the shorts that they wear he says they're from the city trend store so he'd be like city trends <laughs> That's what I feel like these shorts are, city trend shorts. They're kind of like short shorts, but like a longer version of short shorts, if that makes sense. But yeah, just a basic button down shirt, a blazer, and then I threw in this little white bag to kind of tie in with the white and the striped shirt. So you can recreate this outfit with pieces you already have, but of course I'm gonna link my pieces. This blazer, like I said, I've had for six, seven years, but I will link some bright colored blazers if anybody's interested. So check that description, but I love this little, last look i mean i think a lot of us get in those moods where we just want to wear shorts during spring especially when you get to that spring to summer transition era like towards the end of spring it can be really warm and so that's the time a lot of us tend to reach for our shorts and stuff like that so wanted to give you one more shorts outfit besides the black one you saw earlier so this is it hope you guys like these outfits Thank you all so much for checking out this video all about 10 spring outfits that you probably already have in your closet. I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got some great outfit ideas. Spring is that season where we get to kind of have a little fun with our wardrobe because it's not too hot, it's not too cold. So you kind of get to be a little bit more creative with your outfits. So hopefully these outfits will help you to create some really cute looks that you can put together using items that you already have. And of course, I want to send a special thank you to today's video sponsor, Billy. Thank you so much for working with your girl again. 
again, I have fallen in love with your brand. So I am so grateful to work with you all again on another video. Make sure you guys go ahead and check out Billy's new body care line. Their lotions, their deodorants, their body washes are absolutely amazing and they smell good. And the best thing for me is that they look cute in the bathroom. <laughs> I hate to say that, but they are so adorable. I just love their packaging and everything. You all saw it in the insert, so y'all saw how cute the products are. I am absolutely in love. Like, Billy's products are so colorful and fun and girly, and that is something that really draws me in, just that they go that extra mile to put that effort to really, like, appeal to the eyes. So I love Billy, and I hope you all will try them out. All you have to do is click the link in the description and go ahead and check out their body care line. I'm sure you will find something that you love because they got a little bit of everything for everybody. So check them out and of course you definitely want to check out their razors I've talked about their razors in recent videos I am obsessed that is the only razor that I use is Billy's razor so check them out as well as the new body care line thank you Billy for sponsoring today's video and thank you all for watching we about to be cute this spring we about to be fly we about to be stepping out and in these streets so enjoy be safe and I'll see you all on the next one love y'all bye Mwah.